Construction on the new International Container Terminal is now underway at Jack's Port's Blunt Island. Jacksport and marine officials marked the occasion with an official groundbreaking. News for Jack's reporter Ashley Harding was there. And tonight she breaks down the facts and figures and how port officials say that this is going to impact jobs in Jacksonville. And with those words and a multi-million dollar check, so began construction on Jacksport's new international container terminal. It's a beautiful day and that might be a sign in itself, you know, because uh, it's, it's cold now. It's supposed to be the weather, but look at this day. So I mean, even God's shining down on us today. So this is a good day. For those whose hands and hearts are invested in the port, the key word here is work. Vincent Cameron is one of the presidents for the Jacksport Union and says this project paves the way for more cargo moving in and out of this area. This means more ships as well. It equates to folks working in economic development. So it's an exciting time. It's been a heavy lift to get to this point, but we're here now, you know, and we're celebrating the day. Officials with Jack's Port and SSA Marine says the terminal is expected to create or protect around 3,500 jobs over a decade, with a minimum revenue intake of $158 million over 25 years. Maritime Administrator Rear Admiral Mark Busby says with Jacksonville being one of 17 strategic seaports, this ups the for competition. He says this also highlights Jacksport's importance overall. This is where we move military cargo in and out in times of crisis or in times of national emergency. So keeping that capability tuned up is very, very important too, which is why we are happy to make this investment. Officials say this also goes hand in hand with the port's harbor deepening project, which they say will finish in 2023, ahead of schedule. Reporting from Jacksport, Ashley Harding, Channel 4, The Local Station.